welcome back to 15 Minute Chef. I just walked in from work and I have a few things laid out. Tonight is one of my husband's favorites. It's New Orleans style barbecue shrimp and grits. Um, two different types of grits tonight, depending on what you're feeling like. Regular instant grits that I can add cheddar to. Or if you wanna make it a little bit spicy, they now have instant grits with jalapeno and cheddar. Totally decide what you're feeling. We're gonna start it with a little side of salad with goat cheese and some candied pecans and cranberries. Very nice touch. I'm heating up my saute pan to put my shrimp in and now I'm gonna wash my hands. So in case you're wondering what is New Orleans style barbecue shrimp, it's basically Oh God, I hope I say this correctly. Worcestershire sauce with butter and cream. Ooh, that reminds me. Let's get the cream. So I'm heating the pan up. I'm gonna add the shrimp. I tossed my shrimp with a little bit of Tony Sachery seasoning. I'm gonna add a little bit more. Be careful, because the no, the spice will knock you out. You're gonna also finish this recipe with a little bit of butter. While this is cooking, I'm gonna make my grits. Now, I know from making my stepson's grits in the morning, each packet of grits calls for a half a cup of water. Got that memorized right there. One cup of water into the microwave. Ooh, got brownie. We'll start getting that. So while this is cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and add my Worcestershire and let it reduce. Now let me explain something. You wanna pull your shrimp out because you don't want them to overcook. So they have like a nice sear on them right now, but I'm gonna take them out of here because as the Worcestershire is reducing, I don't want the shrimp to turn to rubber and that could happen really fast. Shrimp, squid, all seafood, if you cook it too long, it turns into rubber bands. Turn on our bed hood for just a second. So we're gonna let the Worcestershire, man, that's three times I've said Worcestershire and I haven't messed it up. That's pretty awesome. So we're gonna let the Worcestershire reduce to like a nice thick syrup. And then you're gonna finish it off with a little heavy cream and a little bit of butter. And that's gonna make like this beautiful, what we call a New Orleans barbecue sauce. I like to finish it off with a little bit of seasoning, Tony Sachery's, or you can use em Emerald's all seasoning mix, which is really good, which I love. Um, and in the microwave, I've got a little bit of uh, grits going. And then right here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna add some, make a little salad on the side. Wash my lettuce. Okay, so check it out, look. It's nice, it's thick. Almost to the fact that you might think it's burnt. And then you're just going to add just a little bit of heavy cream to it. And then look. See that right there? It's almost going to make it like a caramel color. Add a little bit more heavy cream. that up. I'm gonna add my shrimp back in now. Coat it in with my sauce. And I'm gonna finish it out with a little bit of butter. I haven't done an episode in so long I don't even know where my utensils are. It's crazy.
So we're gonna melt this butter into the Worcestershire sauce with our uh, with our shrimp. And I'm gonna actually bring y'all over here and I'm gonna give you a close up of what that looks like right there. And you're gonna keep melting the butter very carefully, very slowly, mixing it in. Look how nice that looks. Looks good. Okay. All right, we're gonna pull our grits out. Looking good, looking good. Nice and thick. cheese really nice right there on top. Ooh, yeah. Candy pecans and cranberries. Right there over the top. Looks great. cheese to our grits. Woo! Nice and hot. Now as your grits cool down, they'll also thicken. I'm just going to add a slice. Just a slice of cheese. cheddar grits right there. Woo. When I say they're hot, they are hot. A little bit of ram right there. You guys said it in the comments, y'all wanted to see me plate these, so I'm plating them also. There we go. Right there, right over the top. Husband's off camera, he cannot wait to eat it. Whoa, look at that, that is just beautiful. Let me give you a little close up. Oh, that looks so nice. Little shrimp and grits with a little goat cheese salad. Bon appetit. Can't wait to see y'all again next week for uh, some more 15 minute chef fun. Don't forget to like me on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel and I'll show you how to do more 15 minute meals for $20 or less. You guys have a great holidays if I don't see you again before then.